Hi, I'm Jim Brickle from Adler and Ford in St. Catharines, Ontario. Today we're sitting in the 2024 Ford Escape. We've got some great options when it comes to the display in front of the driver. So, if you want just basic information, here's a digital speedometer showing kilometers per hour as we are in Canada. Now, on the right hand side of the steering wheel, we have back, OK with an up and down and menu. If we choose to go back, it brings up a secondary display on the right hand side. Use the up and down to change that display. So I've chosen an Eco Coach, Fuel Economy, Trip 2, Trip 1. So you can pick and choose what information is being displayed. Now, if you decide you don't want anything on the right, you hit the back arrow and you're back to the original screen. But it's not quite the display you had in mind. This time, instead of hitting the back or the OK, we're going to hit Menu. Now, this is going to give us some more choices. So on Settings, I'm going to hit OK. Display. And up on the top, we're going to add a left gauge. I'm going to add in the tachometer. Always nice to know how the engine's revving. With the classic view, I'm going to add in the round speedometer gauge. Now, I'm also going to add in a secondary speedometer. So this way, I'll have both miles per hour and kilometers per hour. I hit the back arrow, and I hit it again, and one more time. So now, we've got the tachometer on the left, the speedometer in uh, gauge format, with the miles per hour on top, kilometers per hour on the bottom in the digital section. And then we can still hit the back arrow to bring up the right display. So you can have plenty of information showing or very basic and little information. The choice is up to you. I'm Jim Brickle and this is the Ford Escape.